So I'm not in the position that you are used to see me in. I have my leg up on my chair and I'm relaxed and I'm excited to show you this product or talk about this product, but the sun is messing with me, making me mad. It's in my face. But I really want to do this video, guys, because I have a lot of things to do today. Today we are going to talk about gel pens. This is the one that I saw on Instagram. And I was, let me take it out. I was very excited to look into this product. This is from a Pop Color Gel Nail Polish Pen. And let me see what it says on my phone. Let's find it on the Instagram. So I saw this on Instagram and this is their website, Pop Color Girl. I don't know if you can see it, but it's their website. I'm going to put the information down below. And I have these, uh, let me say, nail care, beautiful products. But I was very curious to try these. This is three in one gel nail polish. And they had some beautiful shades. They have this uh, gray that I really th am interested in. Let me say they have the green, the blue one, the purple one, the dark burgundy shade, red, uh, pink, dark pink, also very light nude shade, and they also had the white. So it says three in one gel nail polish, don't need base or top coat anymore, one pet does it all. Fast dry formula, five minutes to complete your nail art. Compared to traditional gel polish, saving money and saving time, but charming color remains the same. Pen shaped appearance, designed portable, portable and easy to use, usually can last for 14 to 21 days. Suitable for natural nails, UV gel nails, false nails, acry acrylic nails, nail tips, etc. No nail damage, damage comfortable and breathable. We must take we must take full resp responsibility for our item. Please feel free to contact us if you have any questions. One step gel nails. This is here it is when it get, gets interesting. They say one step, but actually uh, on the website they have eight different steps. Oh, can't see it. Eight different steps. I don't, can't see the picture, but it said step one, <laughs> using cortical trimmer to dispose dead cells from outside to inside. Step two, use rubbing repair to, t rubbing repair the type, load the nail shape more better, so shape the nail. On step three, use sponge rubbing the polish inside and edge roundly. Step four, using dust brush to clean the, up the nail. S step five, using a thin coat of one step gel pen, coating on the nail. Stage, step six, using UV LED lamp, nail lamp, cure for, for 60 to 120 seconds in UV and LED lamp. Using a thin, a thin coat of one step gel pen, coating on the nail again. And number eight, using UV LED lamp, nail lamp cure for 60 to one, uh, 120 nail seconds in UV and LED lamp. So that's eight steps, not one step. So I was expecting this to work when I read one step, just put it on the nail and you're done. But you do need to coat, take a couple of coats and then of course cure it in the UV lamp. Now, I watched their video, how they use it on the website. I'm going to put a link down below. I bought the white pen because, and it's what I have on my nails today, because I do like white color and I do like to have white nails when it's the winter. And it's because also the white is the hardest nail polish, I think, to do. It kind of reminds me of purple eyeshadows. It's very hard to make, and dark lipsticks. It's very hard to make it even and that look patchy and to look stunning. I never found any white nail polish that was, that blown my mind. All the white, all the white nail polishes that I have tried and there are a lot, they were patchy, they were uneven, they were, uh, it took them too long to dry 
I had to take a couple of coats and it still was uneven and it, they were too thick and I just didn't like them. So I tried this pen and I did, you were going to see me tr putting it on my nails and I did use three coats and uh, let's just keep watching the video and I, at the end I'm going to tell you guys what I think about this. But please keep on watching, Look, check it out how I applied it and how I did and how it looks on my nails and I'll give you my full thoughts. So this formula was very thick and the nail polish wasn't really that pigmented so I had to have three coats. The right hand was a little bit uneven and a little bit too thick but the left hand looks much better after I did the second time. So I'm very happy but I like the left hand more. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed that video. Like I said, I do like uh, this side more than this one. It's still not that opaque, it's not, not still not that perfect, but I'm very, very excited and I really want to try the other shades. The only 
thing is that is stopping me is the shipping cost to ship to Sweden. Not shipping itself, but when it arrives to Sweden. And the pens are not so cheap. If they were cheaper, I would definitely get all of the shades because I do like it. And I'm thinking of buying the other shades because I do really, really like how this applied on my eye, uh, uh, on my eyes. What am I talking about? How this applied on my nails. Now, you know when you just do your, just finish your nails and you hit them hard on something and you ruin your nail polish? That is what happens to me all the time. But not with this nail uh, gel pen. Actually, I did do dishes two, three times. Now, let me start over. I did put this yesterday and I put it to test yesterday. So, I washed my hair. I took two showers. Not at the same time. Night and this morning. So, did I washed my hair, took two showers, did dishes two times, laundry one time, making... 8.4 fluid ounces. I don't think that's much. So I don't think you get a lot of the product. So it is a little bit expensive, but I do like the idea. I think it worked fine. I do want more shades. I really do want more shades because uh, I'm happy with the results. I'm really happy with the results. I can never make my nail polish to last when I do it myself. So guys, if you're curious to try it, try it. I think it's a great product. I just wish I could buy more. And the sun is still there. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And see you in my next video. Bye!